Salesforce Data Architect Certification Exam questions are shared free for your better preparation. 1. Universal Containers, UC, has implemented Sales Cloud for its entire sales organization. UC has built a custom object called Projects underscore C that stores customers' project detail and employee biteable hours. The following requirements are needed. A subnet of individuals from the finance team will need to access to the project's object for reporting and adjusting employee utilization. The finance users will not access to any sales objects, but they will need to interact with the custom object. Which license type a data architect recommend for the finance team that best meets the requirements? A. Service Cloud B. Sales Cloud C. Light Platform Start D. Lighting Platform Plus Answer D. 2. What should a data architect do to provide additional guidance for users when they enter information in a standard field? A. Provide custom help text under field properties. B. Create a custom page with help text for user guidance. C. Add custom help text in default value for the field. D. Add a label field with help text adjacent to the custom field. Answer. A. 3. Universal Containers, UC, is going thought major reorganization of their sales team. This would require changes to a large a number of group members and sharing rules. UC's administrator is concerned about long processing time and failure during the process. What should a data architect implement to make changes efficiently? A. Log a case with Salesforce to make sharing rule changes. B. Enable defer sharing calculation prior to making sharing rule changes. C. Delete old sharing rules and build new sharing rules. D. Log out all users and make changes to sharing rules. Answer. B. 4. Universal Containers, UC, is migrating from a legacy system to Salesforce CRM. UC is concerned about the quality of data being entered by users and through external integrations. Which two solutions should a data architect recommend to mitigate data quality issues? A. Leverage picklist and lookup fields where possible. B. Leverage Apex to validate the format of data being entered via a mobile device. C. Leverage validation rules and workflows. D. Leverage third-party app exchange tools. Answer. A. C. 5. Universal Container require all customers to provide either a phone number of an email address when registering for an account. What should the data architect use to ensure this requirement is met? A. Validation rule B. Required fields C. Apex class D. Process builder Answer. A. 6. Universal Container, U.S., is replacing a homegrown CRM solution with Salesforce. UC has decided to migrate operational, open and active records to Salesforce. While keeping historical records in legacy system, UC would like historical records to be available in Salesforce on an as-needed basis. Which solution should a data architect recommend to meet business requirement? A. Leverage real-time integration to pull records into Salesforce. B. Bring all data Salesforce and delete it after a year. 
c. Leverage mashup to display historical records in Salesforce. d. Build a chair solution to go the legacy system and display records. Answer. c. 7. UC has millions of case records with case history and SLA data. UC's compliance team would like historical cases to be accessible for 10 years for audit purpose. What solution should a data architect recommend? A. Archive case data using Salesforce archiving process. B. Purchase more data storage to support case object. C. Use a custom object to store archived case data. D. Use a custom big object to store archived case data. Answer. D. 8. A customer wants to maintain geographic location information including latitude and longitude in a custom object. What would a data architect recommend to satisfy this requirement? A. Create formula fields with geolocation function for this requirement. B. Create custom fields to maintain latitude and longitude information. C. Create a geolocation custom field to maintain this requirement. D. Recommend app exchange packages to support this requirement. Answer. B. 9. As part of addressing general data protection regulation, GDPR, requirements, UC plans to implement a data classification policy for all its internal systems that stores customer information including Salesforce. What should a data architect recommend so that UC can easily classify consumer information maintained in Salesforce under both standard and custom objects? A. Use app exchange products to classify fields based on policy. B. Use data classification metadata fields available in field definition. C. Create a custom pick list field to capture classification of information on customer. D. Build reports for customer information and validate. Answer. B. 10. Universal Containers, UC, is concerned that data is being corrupted daily either through negligence or maliciousness. They want to implement a backup strategy to help recover any corrupted data or data mistakenly changed or even deleted. What should the data architect consider when designing a field-level audit and recovery plan? A. Reduce data storage by purging old data. B. Implement an app exchange package. C. Review projected data storage needs. D. Schedule a weekly export file. Answer. A.